Two out of five. Too much pain. Causes too much pain and agony. Don't know why it's so popular nowadays. I'm just going to use toilet paper. But this is more environmentally friendly. No more bedhead. A real picture of a real person. Not a glamorous young thing. What's this review for? Five stars. Order them now! Can I just say I'll be reordering them in every color? Here's me rolling and sliding down a mountain because I was too scared to get up. My leggings did not rip even a little bit and I got stuck on rocks and trees. No, that's pretty legit though. That's a good reason. Why have you not delivered my order? I didn't ship it. Perhaps contact the seller. Yeah, thanks. Thank you very much. All right, one star. Not original. Fake. Poor product quality. Poor service by seller. Delivery time below expectation. Seller response. <laughs> oh my god, I love that. Look, real or not, it's just hilarious, man. It's only funny once. It's only funny one time. But damn, that's... <laughs> I no longer have a son. This man ain't my son and the world needs to know. I actually just bought a Neon Genesis Evangelion Garfield sticker off of Amazon and I'm in love with it. My waist size is 32 and length is 36, tall and thin. Congratulations! It works. My teeth are so white they've started taking other people's land. Hey, not bad. 800 bucks for a casket? No complaints from Grandpa. About how quickly would this freeze a large block of ice? Trick question. A large block of ice is already frozen. <laughs> We're starting strong. All right, one out of five stars. Beds should look like beds. I ordered this when I was drunk because I thought it was a giant ice cream sandwich. But it wasn't called an ice cream sandwich. So it seems like you're just stupid. No, you can't blame it on being drunk. Reviews with images. Let's see. Yup, yup. Mm-hmm. How is that relevant? Did he review the product? All right, let's see here. Is it washable? No. Is it washable? Yes. Okay, come on. Which one is it? From the Kavanaugh Company, we've got Alter Bread. 19 bucks. Let's see here. Are these vegan? No, it contains the flesh of Jesus Christ. Man, we're really able to just keep producing stuff with his flesh, huh? Oh my God. Roomier than expected. Too early to tell if my two female cats like this box or not, but I will say it's just as spacious as I'd hoped. The other photos don't really show how large this box is. It's amazing, I'm very happy with my purchase. You're right, this photo at least doesn't show just how large this is. You're freaking me the hell out. All right, five stars, look at me now. Just got my Fiddler's cap. It fits perfect and I love it. It's very comfortable and good looking. My new favorite hat of all time. Anchors away, matey. Look at how happy this fella is. Oh God, a TI-83. What does it smell like? It smells like the tears of an English major trying to complete a math class. Screw you. Is I order my stuff on Wendy? When will it come? If you order on Wendy, you may get your stuff on Trudy or maybe Freddy. Hope that helps. <laughs> Oh, I love it, and I hope the guy understood. Three out of five. I was being chased by a hobo. The Starbucks personnel helped me. I thanked them, but they told me I had to buy a coffee or they would give me to the hobo. Well, what are you gonna do? Get eaten by the hobo or just buy a coffee, dude? Could men wear this? They're narrow in the front. His giblets would most likely fall out. Fall out? People have a very skewed idea of how b work. Let's see here. One out of five, missing letter. Let's take a look here. Absolutely gutted. I've sat down and blown up all the letters to find that the D is missing, but it's been replaced with an extra A. It's my daughter's birthday tomorrow, and now I won't be able to decorate it as planned. Not happy at all. Right. Good for you. All right, perfect score. World's best sponges. If I could give these sponges a million stars, I would. I love them so much, I couldn't even bring myself to use them. So I drew faces on them. Oh, I thought they came like that. They're now my friends, and I have a little over 40 sponges. I am soon ordering more. I love these sponges. They are a gift from God. Works great! Five stars. The Nexus Silent Wired Mouse. My girlfriend and I were on the verge of breaking up because I would keep her up at night with my constant mouse clicking. Not anymore. Consider this relationship saved. This mouse is so silent, she'll sometimes forget I'm even home and invite her lover over. He's a pretty cool guy. You into that sort of thing? That's fine. If everybody's cool with it, no problem. Can you replace the spray when you run out? If you run out of pepper spray, you need to move to a different neighborhood. I also like this one. If I put this in my checked luggage, will it explode? I wouldn't think it would explode. Uh, you just look up TSA requirements, man. See what they say. Are they noisy? Do you hear the feathers moving when your head is on the pillow? No, the geese used are dead. Oh, thank God, man. Five stars. What can you say about scissors? They're scissors. You put one blade on either side of something you wish to cut, squeeze the handles together, and it cuts. Super sharp, too. 
They cut almost as precisely as my father's comments about my career path. Kelly, what is it you do for a living? Now I'm curious. Damn, five stars. They saved my relationship. My girlfriend and I were on the verge of breaking up because I was constantly tracking mud into the apartment and ruining the floors. <laughs> Not anymore. The traction on these boots is so strong that I'm able to walk up the walls. The floors are clean, and her nagging has stopped. Now, all we fight about is her crippling alcoholism and my unhealthy obsession with Anna Kendrick. No, I can understand that obsession. Be careful of wrong way bananas? We were so excited to get our Hutzler 571 until we realized our bananas are curved the wrong way. Gonna have to go to the store for new bananas. You guys seem really fun, actually. I love it. Five stars. Even I could make it work, and I took the nicest picture of myself in 50 years. I love how wholesome some of these actually can be. It's, it's a nice break, you know what I mean? Can I make an invisibility cloak from this thread, and if so, how do I find it when I take it off and lay it down somewhere? Uh, yes, and you have to make sure to hang it up properly in the same place every day. I made one myself once, and it fell off the hanger and onto my dog. I haven't seen him in years, but his bark still haunt the halls of my home at night. Is it bear-proof? Nothing is bear-proof. False. There are bear-proof things. Hey, it's the 55-gallon drum of lube! That's like two grand. As UPS discreetly unloaded my 55-gallon drum, the driver accidentally spilled it onto my driveway. Any amount of cars can now fit into the garage. <laughs> Oh man, I remember the first Prime Day when this thing was like $1,800, which was like half off, and people were freaking out like, Oh my god, a lifetime supply of lube, and then you get a 55-gallon drum after you're empty. One star. Very disappointed. Very disappointing! We named ours Bob, and let me tell you that he wasn't the hard-working man I was hoping for. Bob spent most of his employment driving from one random side of the house to the other like a junkie looking for his new fix. His actual cleaning was minimal at best, and he couldn't find his docking station to save his life. In the week I had Bob, he never finished a cleaning cycle. One day while at work, the app texted me to say Bob needed my assistance because he was stuck on a cliff. Worried for Bob's safety, I came home to find him passed out in the middle of the dining room rug. That night, the family said goodbye to Bob once and for all. Yeah, I prefer just doing vacuuming manually. I think Roombas are stupid. Amazing thing! My husband opened the package while I was out. He couldn't figure out what it was. He thought it was a cat harness. Oh, Girlfriend loved this wine. Mother-in-law hated it. Double win. Wait, girlfriend and mother-in-law. I'm confused. My partner has a love of all things different. So. Plum wine was a must for her birthday. She tried it and has been consistently trying to pour it down anyone's throats that can try it. I had to try myself. It's somewhat dry, smooth, and sweet at the same time. It's certainly got a very different taste to your standard grape wines. Somewhere between a very strong cider and a dry wine. Mother-in-law hated it, so it's worth every penny. All right, another five stars. This eyeliner won't run around like your man does. I bought this eyeliner, and the first day I wore it, I found out my boyfriend of five years was cheating on me, and I cried and cried and cried and went to the bathroom to make sure that my makeup streaks were wiped off of my face, but it was completely perfect. Through all the crying, it stayed in place. So thank you for making an eyeliner that's more trustworthy than a man. All right. Customer questions. Does the cord to this lamp contain chemicals known to cause cancer? Do you plan on eating it? Well, I would have said only in California. It's heavy. I sometimes receive documents in larger than your average letter size that are clearly labeled do not bend. My mailman seems to be either lazy or incompetent or both. And instead of leaving these documents on my doorstep or porch, because this would require getting out of the car, he bends and folds them, then stuffs them into my mailbox anyway. This often will crease important documents or photos. So whenever this happens, I log on to Amazon and order a 50-pound bag of play sand. While it doesn't decrease my documents, it does make me feel a lot better about watching him deliver it. Works fine, I cannot hear my wife. Thanks, Alan. How it works. Airzooka is the fun gun that blows a harmless- Oh man, I miss the Airzookas. Let's see. Can you force a fart into it and blow it into someone's face across the room? I can confirm this. I received one of these as a Christmas gift while deployed. Naturally, it took a few minutes for two of my soldiers to attempt firing a fart through it. The key is to have the gunner cock and hold the weapon while the loader does his thing. It took nearly two full seconds for the blast across the tent, resulting in the Major suddenly flailing his arms and yelling, Oh God, I got it in my mouth. 10 out of 10. Best present received that year. One star. Split in the crotch. I was wearing these shorts around the house when a few friends stopped by. We were all sitting around watching TV when I reached at a weird angle for the remote. The crotch seam pulled apart and my scrotum came spilling out right in front of my friends. This was pretty embarrassing. Picture not attached. Came out through your underwear? Recommended by world's worst mom. I bought this for a generally ungrateful and entitled 21-year-old daughter. 
She wears about a 12. Usually I order an XL. It fit and looked great on her, and if she had refrained from her moodiness, it would have been an even better effect. When I listened to her list, my myriad of faults, this cute dress gave me some distraction to try to tune her out. It cost about the same as a pack of birth control pills in 97, which may have been a more prudent investment. Jesus. Okay. Five stars. My wife bought this for our pregnancy announcement, and it was too big. I saw my opportunity and knew what I had to do. This dress does it all. You want to feel pretty? Check. Majestic? Sure. Pregnant? Of course. Hot? It's lit, fam. I'd rate this a perfect five out of five. I'm not sure how it works for the ladies, but it made me feel like a queen. In the reviews for a weighted blanket, one star. I miss my wife. This is gonna be fun. I never considered the ramifications of this. Sure, the wife loves it, but if you buy it, you'll never be able to get close to your wife again. It creates a freaking wall of china in bed. It's like she's wearing a freaking suit of armor to bed every night. I hate this thing, you know? Took me years to finally get one, but I was finally sent a 15-pound weighted blanket by the Finnish GF, and it's been nice. I don't think I can go back to just normal blankets on their own. <sighs> I'm crying while typing. My ex-girlfriend bought this on my account. I'm still hurt from the breakup, but Amazon's bugging me about a review, so... Oh, I'm a lurker on her Instagram, so I see the outfit and give an honest review on her behalf. Even though I was unable to see it in person, she looks great in this two-piece and it fits every curve just right. I can just imagine all the attention she's getting in this. Although I'm sad, I'm very happy she made this purchase. What the hell, man? Fan blade broken while I was sleeping. This product is not safe. I was sleeping and the fan just broke and hit part of my head. Five stars. Okay. Beware, not a nature documentary. I figured with the title that it was a documentary and how urbanization is affecting wildlife, but no, it's about some scumbag that does a bunch of drugs and has a boat. Top reviews. Dude, it's happiness. I seriously don't write reviews like this. I don't write reviews, but I have been grumpy every morning since I knew myself, and this indoor garden thingy changed my mornings. Like, I actually don't care if basil, is it basil, grows up or not, but it makes me curious to see if it grew anyway. At least some sort of excitement. One time I saw the first small leaf. Dude, that was the best morning. I'm happy for you, man. Why does it smell when it... Wait, why does it smell and when does it go away? Mine has no smell. Maybe you should wash your ass. A lot of people just don't do that, and it's very concerning. Be sure you really need 60 condoms before you buy 60 condoms. So, these are some great condoms, right? But I'm just here to give you some life advice. I bought these back when I was in a relationship with someone way out of my league. I figured, after how long we'd been together, I should just start buying protection in bulk, right? So I buy 60 condoms, and we keep getting it on for a while until she dumped me. Now I have a drawer, by my bed, full of completely superfluous condoms. They sit there mocking me as I drunkenly cradle myself to sleep, cold and alone in my pathetic excuse of an apartment. Great product, though. Good lube. It's lube, not much to say. Sometimes I let cover my body in it and pretend to be a slug while sliding around my bathroom. Dude, that is an ancient copypasta comment, man. Well, it fits the cat. My 16-year-old daughter bought this thing. It's ridiculously small, and I probably couldn't legally post a picture of what it looks like if she attempts to wear it. But, so you can see, here's a picture of our cat wearing it. To be fair, it does cover all the cat's nipples, however, she hates the weave. In summary, don't buy this, even for your cat. My dog loves them. Dogs love these chews. Not too big, either. The dogs love them! Dear AKC, your long-lasting bone lasted all of five minutes. If that's your idea of a long-lasting bone, then I feel sorry for your wife. Oh my god. Two out of five stars. A fun way to ruin a weekend and blow a hundred bucks. We took this ball out to the beach, and after a, oh, close to two hours to pump it up, we pushed it around for about ten fun-filled minutes. That was when the wind picked it up and sent it hurtling down the beach at about 40 knots. It destroyed everything in its path. Children screamed in terror at the giant inflatable monster that crushed their sandcastles. Grown men were knocked to the were knocked down. I can't read today. God. Knocked down trying to save their families. The faster we chased it, the faster it rolled. It was like it was mocking us. Eventually, we had to stop running after it because its path of injury and destruction was going to cost us a fortune in legal fees. Rumor has it it could still be seen stalking innocent families on the Florida panhandle. We lost it in South Carolina, so there's something to be said about its durability. <laughs> yeah, that's... That's definitely a gamble. It's just gonna end up in the ocean as more plastic that's, well, a waste. My cat is special. The product itself is fine, and I assume it works as it's designed to if your cat actually gets in it. My cat's struggling with understanding how to use it, and after having it for over a month, still has not actually sat in it once. Well, three out of five stars isn't fair then. Just return it and stop. They're spoons. Spoon-shaped and great for spoon-type activities. Hard to review a spoon. 
They're spoon-shaped and haven't failed to do any spoony actions. I just haven't asked any of them today. Well, it's definitely a bucket. Includes all the features you love from a bucket. Roundness, bucketness, comfort plastic grip, holds water and other things. Easy five stars. Oh my god, that image. Locator beacon for ninja alpaca. Stealthy alpaca is, well, stealthy. He's very difficult to locate on my five acre uh, wherever in the dark. He doesn't make any audible noises, and unlike the horses, you can't even hear his footsteps. He takes great pleasure in hiding behind bushes and not revealing his location as I walk past just 10 feet away calling his name. I'm sick of thinking he's escaped, stolen, or dead. Illumicene Collar solves the problem. Ninja no more. Haha, <laughs> sucker. I hate these shoes. Five stars. I hate these shoes. Yes, I gave it a five star rating and I hate them. I'm a cook and I have to wear non-slip footwear to work. I've tried many different non-slip shoes over the course of a decade and these are the most reliable, easiest to clean, affordable, and utilitarian shoes I've found. My feet never hurt. Let me repeat that. My feet never hurt. But here's the thing. These shoes are so ugly. I hate wearing them and they do not breathe at all. But they allow me to do my job without having to worry about my feet and that is legitimately all I can really ask of a work shoe. So, I'll continue to order these stupid shoes every 9 to 12 months when the non-slip bottoms wear out until I graduate from college and I can finally tell the company for whom I work to suck it. I've been a professional medium for 15 and a half years and am very sensitive to all of the energy forces that surround us. The instructors are great and the facility is clean, but when I walked into the studio I was assaulted by the dark energy radiating from Monica at the front desk. Hey man, that's not cool. Monica didn't do s*** to you. Never drink 5 hour energy. Whatever you do, do not fill up a super big gulp cup with 5 hour energy and chug the whole thing. My heart has either stopped completely or is beating so fast I can't my own pulse. Cons. I haven't slept in 72 hours, can't feel my face, I peed this morning and I'm pretty sure it was 99% blood. Pros. I've deep cleaned my entire apartment and I can read minds. 5 stars. I'm the author and I think I did a pretty good job. Very efficient. Extremely good cutter. Cuts almost through everything, including skin, tendons, and flesh. Thumbs up for this product. Was that its intended use? I mean, was it really? Does this shoot ice-cold toilet water right up your butthole? Yes. Can this double as a drinking fountain? Yes. Does it tickle? Yes, but only in a good way. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Tell me how shipping crickets in this way makes any sense at all. I opened the box and my house was flooded with hundreds of tiny crickets the size of coffee grounds. I am disgusted. Maybe just don't order crickets on Amazon in the future. It's a trap. Not only does this beanbag completely consume you and keep you stuck in comfortable bliss all day, but there was another consequence we encountered. This beanbag traps farts. My husband sits there farting for hours and the farts are absorbed into the beanbag and you don't smell them again until you sit on it. And then the fumes are released. Super comfortable, traps farts. Sweet, beautiful silence. I've had a cricket somewhere in my kitchen for weeks. I've searched high and low for it. For a while, I thought it was my fridge making sounds. Was it? I'm not sure. I was losing my sanity. Sometimes it happened during the day or at night. Sometimes it would stop and then I would come in and it would start where I left. Uh, once I heard the chirping and metastasized in the back of my mind. It's all I could hear. I couldn't sleep. It was just the chirping of the cricket. Always. Endlessly. The first night with this trap out there, there were no results and I thought I was doomed. This is my life now. Nothing could rid me of this troublesome cricket. The only thing left is to burn this house to ashes. Then, on the second night, I'm sitting at home and what do I hear? Nothing. Nothing at all. Beautiful. Blissful. Silence. I dug out the trap and what do I find? The one singular cricket. He looked at me as if to say, Father, is it over? And I softly replied, No king lives forever, my son. And I chucked his ass in the trash. Is it melodramatic to say a $5 insect trap changed my life? I'm not sure. But it did. 10 out of 10. Would recommend.